What's good guys and welcome back to the channel. Recently I've had a lot of people asking for short videos so I'm really excited to share this company with you. As you can see by the title it is Bare Bottom Clothing but they have a ton of different short styles. I only have I would say like 70% here but I am going to try them each on and give my thoughts. So let's go ahead and get started. Before we get started, I just want to mention a couple things. So for every item that Bare Bottom sells, they actually donate a pair of shorts to someone in need, which is awesome. I love when companies give back like that, that's super cool. Another thing I wanted to mention is that they kind of categorize their shorts in two different styles. One is like casual and then the other is active. So for the casuals, I'll be reviewing the stretch shorts and the volley shorts and then for the actives, it'll be the Atlas shorts, and then I also have the Run V2 shorts. And for the last pair of shorts is their Stretch Swim Trunks, and these are sick, so stay tuned for those, but let's actually get started now. Okay, first up, I will start with the active shorts, and these are the Atlas. So I just want to show you what these look like up close. Super stretchy waistband. On the inside here, they have the drawstrings, and it seems to be like a common theme that they have the silicone, like, I don't know, it's like it was dunked in it. I've never really seen them like this, because it's not hard. It's kind of squishy. Pretty cool. Okay, back up. On the back here, we have a metal zipper. And I'll show you all of this when I actually try them on too, but I just want to kind of show you up close, show you the material. Okay, here is the actual materials. It is 85% recycled nylon and then 15% polyester. For the sizes, just for reference, I am six feet tall, 165 pounds. I usually always wear a size medium in like my bottoms. Um, these are all gonna be seven inch inseam they do offer seven or five and a half. So seven is kind of short for some people, but that's like perfect for me. But if you guys are gonna try and like transition, cause I know that's kind of the style now to wear a little bit shorter shorts, I would say seven inches perfect. If you're like a little more risky, five and a half, that, you know, do your thing. It's not really for me, I think seven's perfect. Um, as far as this material goes, it is pretty thin, pretty thin but it feels like pretty durable. Uh, kind of reminds me of like those swishy pants. That used to be cool back in the day. Go ahead and try these on. All right, so here are the Atlas shorts. I just want to show you, I have a iPhone 12 Pro Max. So that's really important for me to make sure like the pockets are big enough in shorts like this. So goes down to right here. Also within that side of the pocket, there's a, another internal pocket right here. And that's where you can put your iPod, or AirPods, sorry. That goes down to it right here. As you can see, they fit nice and slim. I absolutely hate when um, shorts are too wide, like, and it looks like you're just wearing like parachutes. So these are actually the most slim out of all the shorts, and I wish they all fit like these. So, you know, so these are probably my favorite fitting out of all the shorts. As you can see, there are little drawstrings right here if you want to make it tighter. Alright, next up is the run shorts. These are the version 2, and this is like the carbon black color. I thought these were sick. I love that, that like speckled look and very similar material as the Atlas shorts, very thin, but since these are technically the run shorts, they do have these like reflectors right here. here you have the bare bottom logo. Another thing, they this one also has a zipper in the back, but it's a little bit different because it's not fully metal. It has like this little plastic part, which I might like better. 
Nice pocket there. Pockets go pretty deep. Go ahead and try these ones on for you. Alright guys, here are the run shorts. I'm going to like, show you up close. The color is sick. Love these. As you can see, the drawstrings are on the outside this time. You do have the reflectors right here and then there's also a little split right there. Pockets go down to right here and both of these pockets have like the internal side pocket for AirPods just in case you prefer one side over the other. Uh, yeah, these are super nice. I think they fit like a little tiny bit wider than the first ones, but not by much. Alright, moving into our first pair of casual shorts. These are the volley shorts. And I was really excited for these. All the colors that they offer are sick. I love this faded look that they have. Um, normally I'm a drawstrings on the inside kind of guy, but I actually like this one. Look really cool. They have the like, hard, I don't know what that is, like, it's not really silicone. It feels like plastic. Again, these are size medium, 7 inch inseam. I can't read that, but hopefully you guys could. <laughs> And turn this around. This one does not have a zipper pocket. Just a uh, pocket right there, and I'll show you when I try them on. It's fairly deep on the inside. I just want to show you like what the material is for the pockets. It's like this nice mesh, pretty stretchy waistband. And try them on. Nice mesh liner. This, it feels really good, like in the pockets. Even though that's mesh, it feels like really high quality. There are no internal pockets within these pockets. Draw strings, again, on the outside here. I think they fit really, really nice. And the last pair for our casual shorts is the stretch short. Really cool because they have this stretchy waistband. This one is, I believe, 97% cotton, 3% spandex. And the material feels really nice, kind of like a, like a chino short. It's a little bit like heavier than the other ones. Um, it feels like it was like rubbed like sand it down like a, with a really fine sand paper to make it have that like suede feeling a little bit. So it feels really nice. I love this color. This is like one of my favorite colors, this lighter sage color. Pretty sick. In the back here, we have a pocket, the button. That looks tight. Pretty deep. Try these on. Pretty cool. I want to show you like when I was putting them on. Like they're pretty snug. Like so it's making me um, stretch it out to secure it. Which I like because then it stays like snug. So they fit nicely in that aspect. These ones are like the widest of the bunch. So if I could just maybe take like an inch off, uh, I, I probably would, but most people would not even notice that. <laughs> uh, okay. A little spin. Okay. All right, 
right, and last but not least, probably my favorite item that I have from them is the Swim Stretch. These again are medium, seven inch inseam. If you guys are looking for a nice fire bathing suit for the summer, I highly recommend this one. They have a couple that are nice, but this one for me, I was like, wow, like that's exactly what I'm looking for. Love the contrast, even with the drawstrings. Just looks really, really nice. They have this mesh liner. Um, it's like kind of stretchy, but I don't know if I'm a huge fan of the liner. I'll probably end up cutting that out. They do have a zipper back here. Really nice. Feels pretty high quality. They are thin. They feel very similar to the first couple for the active shorts. Looks like. All the stitching is like perfect. There were no frays at all. Absolutely love these. Can't wait to wear these to the beach. I actually live in a beach town. I haven't tried them out yet, but I have been to the beach, I just haven't tried them out yet. Really excited to wear these though. They do have a little split here on the side. Got the zipper pocket. It's pretty deep. These things are fire. All right, and I actually have one more item I didn't mention. These are the stretch joggers. They are the exact same material as the stretch shorts, same color and everything. I was hesitant to order these because I couldn't tell if they were gonna be slim enough for me, for like my style. So I'll try them on and let you know what I think. You let me know what you guys think. Um, but yeah, it's the same, same thing. You got those stretchy waistband right here. As you can see, the tag's still on because I'm probably going to return them. And I'll let you know why when I try them on. You got the two pockets right there with the buttons. And try them on. Alright guys, here are the stretch joggers. I actually got a size small and the tall version because I wanted them to be like as slim as possible. Um, the reason why I'll be returning them is just because I feel like they kind of like parachute out at the ankles here and the waist is really tight because they are small and I'm typically a medium so that makes it a little bit uncomfortable but they're not terrible and I don't I guess like the um, the elastic band like that I don't really care for that look in joggers I guess it's not my number one choice but definitely not terrible like I don't hate it Alright guys, now for the ratings. First up, we have the Atlas short. For fit, it's getting a 3.8 out of 4. For comfort, a 2.5 out of 3. And then for style, another 2.5 out of 3. I really wish they had these in more colors. They only have, I think, like a gray, this navy, and a black. So that's why I give it a lower score on style, but that gives them a total of 8.8. .8. All right, next up is the run short. These are the V2. This is getting a 3.6 out of four for fit. For comfort, a 2.5 out of three. And for style, 2.7 out of three. I absolutely love the way these ones looked. The specs look really, really cool. They also have that side split. Um, I could probably do without the little reflectors, but that's because I don't run in the road and I don't need cars to see me so but that's not a big deal um, I, I definitely love, love these ones so that gives them a total of 8.8 .8. next up is the first out of the casual shorts this one's the volley short and it is getting a 3.8 out of 4 for fit for comfort a 2.5 out of 3 and then for style a 2.6 out of 3 again I absolutely love that faded look 
Looks really cool. All the other colors are awesome as well, but I chose these faded black. That gives them a total of 8.9. Next up is the stretch short. These are getting a 3.5 out of 4 for fit. They just are a little bit wider than all the other ones, probably by like an inch on each leg. Um, so that's why they're getting a little bit lower of a score there. For comfort, a 2.4 out of 3. A little bit lower on that score too, just because uh, they are stretchy, but they're like a little more stiff when the other ones are just like so, I guess, thin. You don't really, really notice that they're there. So it just makes these ones a little bit less comfortable. It doesn't mean they're not comfortable though. Next is Style, and they're getting a 2.5 out of 3. I do love these colors, um, but they're kind of just, you know, they're, they're pretty basic. So I think that's a fair score. Total, 8.4 out of 10. All right, and lastly, we have Absolute Fire. <laughs> these are the Stretch Swim Shorts. And for fit, they're getting a 3.7 out of 4. For comfort, 2.5 out of 3. And for style, 2.8 out of 3. Absolutely love these ones. They are probably my favorite pair of swim trunks that I've ever had. So, pumped to wear these. Absolutely love them. That gives them a total of 9.0 out of 10. Alright, for the stretch joggers, I'm going to give them a 3.3 out of 4. I wish I could have got the mediums, because typically I'm a medium, but I went ahead and got the small and tall length, um, but I could tell the mediums wouldn't have been slim enough for my like liking, so that's what I'm basing these off of. For comfort, 2.4 out of 3, and then style, another 2.4 out of 3. I'm just not a huge, huge fan of like this kind of jogger. Like, not only is it not that comfortable on your ankle, I just don't care for that look. I like when it's more... Um, like seamless, like not like I'm a cuff, boom, right in your face, <laughs> you know. Uh, that gives it a total of 8.1 out of 10. All right, guys, that is it for this video. Please let me know if you have any questions in the comments below. If you are not yet subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. I post new videos just like this one every single week. I have a really cool company to review next week, but stay tuned for that, and I will see you guys on the next one.